Good morning, Western Hills. I'm Michael Miller. And I'm Adrian Lepore. And these are your announcements for Tuesday, January 28th. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now, the Texas Pledge. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to the Texas, one state, under God, one and indivisible. Do you pine for the days of walking down the hall in a straight line? Do you remember cutting and coloring and pasting valentines with great longing? Does the memory of a reading circle bring nostalgic tears to your eyes? Enroll in the teaching internship class for next year and go to one of the lo seven local elementary schools to assist a the teacher there. Double honors credit. Enrollment forms for the program may be obtained by Ms. Fonville, room 232, or Ms. Payne, room 223. Come by ASAP. Space is limited. Do not forget the girls' basketball team will be having senior night and faculty night next Friday, January 31st. Be there, be there, be there. Seniors, we have six new scholarship applications available in the counseling office. If you are interested, please come by the counseling office. Seniors, if you have not completed your FAFSA or TASFA, please see any of the counselors for assistance. The more time you waste, the less money you can get for college. And now breaking news announcement from Denver Blackwell. Breaking news from JROTC! JROTC is a great opportunity for anyone to demonstrate their character. If you have ever wondered what it's like to be in the JROTC, talk to the cadets outside the cafeteria all day this week. And now back to Adrian and Michael. It's not every day that you get to rub elbows with an ambassador. Are you interested in being part of the school ambassador international experience but can't host a student? We have other opportunities for you to participate. As we prepare for the visiting Indonesian student delegation, there is a need for helpers. The Ambassador School Committee is another way for you to help make this partnership successful. The committee will implement the program itinerary planned for the visiting students during the week of March 17th through the 29th. Particular emphasis will be the welcoming program when the students arrive from the DFW airport and the farewell dinner on March 26th. If you are interested in serving on this committee, please meet in room 125 on Tuesday, January 28th during lunch. Thank you. We have this short announcement from Mrs. Garcia. If you have been invited to join the Spanish Arms Society, but have not yet signed the signature sheet in Ms. Garcia's room, Wednesday is the last day to do so. If you don't sign up on Wednesday, you will not be included in the induction ceremony. Western Hills High School sophomore Aspen Leonard earned an awesome Android tablet. Aspen had perfect attendance for the third reporting period. The Android tablet was donated by her friends from Farmers Insurance of Benbrook office of Cynthia Irvin. Farmers Insurance Representative Melissa Irvin presented the prize to Aspen on January 23rd at Western Hills High School. Farmers Insurance is committed to supporting the students at Western Hills. Aspen's excited to receive the Android tablet. Aspen plans on using the Android tablet for her academics and entertainment. Way to go, Aspen! Attendance recovery will be available to all Western Hills students who need to make up lost time for the fall 2013 semester. Our next school-wide attendance recovery will be held in the cafeteria from 3.45 to 4.45 on January 3rd, 4th, 5th, and 6th. Students can recover one hour for each afternoon they attend. Please pay our registrar, Ms. Jordan, $10 by January 31st to reserve your spot. This will be the last school-wide attendance recovery to make up lost time from the fall 2013 semester. Students are encouraged to review their fall 2013 attendance record. Credit is lost in a class at 10 or more absences. Western Hills wants your opinion. In the library, there is now a drop box where you can drop off your opinion. These opinions will be based on a question on the box. For example, it could say, what do you think about Western Hills High School? And tell us what you think. These questions will be collected by students and presented to the superintendent. Also, do not write anything inappropriate. You're not cute and you're not funny. You're just looking mature. And then... Did, did we did an attendance recovery thing twice? Yeah. Two different ones? Okay, I'll pick the one that's best. This has been Cougar TV. I'm Michael Miller. And I'm Adrian LaCour. And have a tantalizing Tuesday.